Hey folks, today we are going to make a Texas style toast with some sauteed mushrooms. Now, I'm going to put this delicious herb oil on the mushrooms. So we're gonna make the herb oil first. And this is super simple to make and will last in your refrigerator for weeks. So I'm gonna use about a cup and a half of olive oil to a half a cup of canola oil or grapeseed oil, whatever you got. Let's mix these together and then I have uh, parsley chopped. This is thyme. Toss that in. And you can use either basil or fresh oregano. I'm using fresh oregano here. Toss that in. And then shallots. And don't forget the garlic. So once you give this a stir, you can set it aside and let all those flavors marry together. Let's set that there. I just bought whatever like giant crusty loaf of bread was in the grocery store. Now the Texas part of the toast is the thick part of the toast. So we wanna cut it at least an inch or more thick. So I'm gonna take this toast and I'm gonna paint both sides of it with, with a little bit of uh, vegan butter. This is ready to go in the pan. We're gonna set it aside and prepare our mushrooms. I have about a half a pound of mushrooms here and I'm gonna put about a cup of herb oil on them. Make sure they're good and coated. Test the pan. Oh, we are ready. Now you wanna get a pan big enough where your mushrooms are gonna hit, all of your mushrooms are gonna hit the bottom of the pan so you can get a nice even uh, fry on them. So let's cover them up. Okay, let's check them. Oh, these smell delicious, and they look to me to be about done. Let's just put the toast face down. Oh, that looks good. I think we're ready. Now, let's top this baby with some mushrooms. Let's top it with a little bit of, or a lot, of feta. There we go. And I'm just gonna put some fresh chives on top and be done with it. There you have it. Texas toast with sauteed mushrooms. I wanna eat this now. 